the next thing I would say to somebody who is actually getting into fitness is do not skip. Yo, what is good, everybody? We are back in the video. Today, I want to make a video about things you should know before you start getting into the gym or you start getting into fitness or you want to better yourself, whatever the case may be. These are just some things I believe you should know before you start your journey. And these are some things I will actually tell my younger self if I could go back in time and tell myself before I start getting into the gym and all this thing. All right, so number one, focus on having good form instead of lifting heavy. I've made this mistake so many times and I see a lot of people making this mistake too. They wanna, they think that if I could lift the heaviest amount of weight, then I'll be able to build the biggest amount of muscle or the most muscle. When you lift heavy and you haven't even mastered your form yet, you're just increasing the chances of yourself getting injured. Now I'm not saying when you have good form, you gotta stay with that number for the rest of your life, never increase the weight. No, that's not the point. What I'm trying to say is progressive overload throughout your whole, you know, your whole career of you in the gym or however long you've been in the gym for. Focus on the tens. Once you get good with the 10 pound dumbbells, now increase it by 15. Once you start getting good with the 15, go with the 20s, then the 25 and etc. Once you make it to the number that you always want. Just focus on proper form because they'll be able to increase your mind muscle connection and you will be able to be able to build more muscle because you have a better mind muscle connection. And the second thing you need to know if you are trying to get into the gym or you're gonna start your fitness journey, focus on eating healthy foods, mostly healthy foods. Your diet should be consistently on really good nutritional foods. Now I'm not saying cut out junk food or you cannot have candy, you can't have a fast food restaurant or you can't go out to eat. I'm not saying that. Literally, I do it. I eat some fast foods once in a while. Just eat it in moderation. Be smart with your choices. Do not eat this every day and expect that your body is going to change positively. It's not going to. You know, I made this mistake when I first started lifting. I heard the term, eat big to get big. You gotta eat a lot of food to be as big as possible and not worry about tracking your calories, how much protein you're eating, how much carbs you're eating, how much fat you're eating. I made that mistake and it pretty much wasted a really good amount of time of training for me because, I, first of all, I wasn't even training properly. All I trained was arms. I was just eating whatever I found. And it just, my physique was not the best. I needed that to happen to me so I could actually properly learn how to properly eat foods, why macros are important and all that. So yeah, just be smart with the, the food you're eating. Actually build a well-balanced diet. Build meals that you are gonna enjoy and are actually really beneficial for you in your journey of fitness. So yeah, that'll be the second thing. And just a quick reminder, if you guys are interested in following me on any of my social media, I have a TikTok and I have an Instagram. I'll link both of those down below. And if you guys are really enjoying my videos, please feel free to leave a like leave a comment, subscribe to the channel because it really helps bring up the algorithm on these videos. Really appreciate that. If you guys are really enjoying the content, please leave a like, leave a comment. It really helps the videos out. The next thing I would say to somebody who is actually getting into fitness is do not skip on rest days. Rest days are really important when you are trying to build muscle and you are trying to bring out the best like the maximum performance that you could give in the gym, in your diet and everything like that. You know, you always hear this term and I see it on social media a lot. Oh, people who take rest days, they're betas. Like they're not really dedicated to this. Do not listen to that because I made that mistake. I did not take one rest day at one point in my life. And I thought, yeah, I was making great gains. Yeah, I was training hard, but then there will be times where like I'm so sore that I can't even train properly. Like I can't even feel my muscle properly. Like all I was doing was going through the motion and I was just, I just was not in a good place. If you are always in the gym and you're not recovering that muscle 
how do you expect that muscle to grow? It's not going to grow. Your muscles grow when they're recovering. Muscle tissue comes throughout time when you are recovering and you're eating enough protein. And yeah, you are, and you are training hard enough throughout your time period. Take rest days seriously. Rest days could really help you on your journey if you are trying to make your body the best version of itself. If you guys are new to making it to the end of the videos, I always like to give a bonus tip to the people who make it to the end. The bonus tip for this video would be, do not try to rush the process. I made this mistake when I started. I try to rush things. I thought the heavier I was getting every day was good progress. I'm building a lot of muscle. I'll let give you guys a little story right now. When I started, I was 115 pounds. My goal was, you know what? I want to get as heavy as possible, everything like that. So you know what? I just started eating a lot of food. I started training properly and everything like that. And then I hit 170. I had 170 pounds. I remember calling my cousin and everything like that. I was excited. I was like, whoa, I'm 170 pounds. I'm, I'm pretty big, everything like that. And I look at myself in the mirror and all I saw was just a mess. I didn't even look like I lifted. I literally couldn't see my abs, no development in any of my muscles. I was skipping leg days, everything like that. And all because I just wanted to hit a number. Do not rush this process. It takes time, it's slow. You're not here to impress anybody. Nobody's waiting for you at the finish line. This is your journey. Progress takes time. So yeah, and I think that's gonna be it for the end of the video. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video because I feel like a lot of people need to hear this video if you are trying to start. And I really think this will be helpful for a lot of people. So please share this video with anybody who's trying to get into fitness or who is just, who needs a little bit of guidance with their journey. Like always, guys, I hope you guys are grinding every day. I hope you guys are working hard towards your goal. I hope we are all praying to God because without God, you know, we can't really achieve a lot of things in this world. So, yeah, thank you for watching this video. I hope you guys have a blessed day. Stay safe.